Want to jump? Of what? The ball? No. Right there's quarter dome. Right about there's where Sebastian turned around. Sebastian and I. That's how close he came. He'll be up in a couple of years to do it again. Here we have Nevada Falls. Pretty cool stuff. There's the switchbacks. See off to the left? About midway. I'll try and zoom in here. See that big, huge, looks like a big, huge tree. You see some people just below. See my viewfinder? Oh, yeah. See him? Yeah. The guy's in kind of a red. Uh huh. Huh. Yeah. No, oh, thanks. The hardest part. That might be the hard part right there. You know, it didn't bother me, fear wise, because I knew I could just fall in between the planks. Yeah. But when I came down and all those people were there, yeah. I don't understand how people fall. They get on the outside of it. They get on, it's yeah. the only really way yeah, that you can. It's the could. only way you can lose it. Because if you started, you're gone. But if you're in those ten, every, you're only going to go ten feet, and you got a board. Yeah. But there, I don't remember the, how far out the boards were. Chris is showing us the proper sleeping technique for his tent. As you can see, his legs are exposed, but at least the core of his body is in the tent. Now, now that we've had the Polish Army instruction, <laughs> that would be more of a joke that my dad would tell because he was in World War II. Oh, yeah. No way. Office call. Chris is roughing it. Hey, sweetie, how are you? Hi, sweetie. <laughs> oh, man. This is terrible. <laughs> it's cold, and I got my ski gloves. <coughs> Very cold. All right, bud. You're done. Good eye, mate. This is how the Rangers rough it. They have a solar panel right on the, the stream. Got a little hose. The pump pumps the water up to their their cabin. That is not moving at all. The water? No.
All right, greetings from the top of Half Dome. And over here we see Roy. Just made it up the ropes. Woo! Just made it up the cables. I made it up not too long ago, dressed in my snazzy hat. Beautiful morning, it's about 7.45. October 1st, the greatest month in the universe. You know, my birthday is in this month, and Alex's, and Halloween, and the annexation of Nevada into the Union. So, it's a pretty good time. So, we'll take some video of the top of the dome in just a minute. Oh, these cables are brutal. I did not look down. Well, I did like once or twice, but it wasn't nearly as scary as I thought it would be. So I think going down is going to be worse. But half the battle is over. It's a bit chilly out. It's probably in the 40s. We're the only ones at the top of Half Dome. We passed one person coming down the cables. We've only seen two people on the trail this morning. So it's a good day. Over here we see lots of ducks on the mountain that people have made. Kind of cool. My goal is to get back down. <laughs> yeah, that's good. I'm waiting for you to come down. Action shot down the cables. October 1st, 2009. The only ones on the mountain. Half Dome. Yosemite, California, USA World. My gloves started like getting smelled like burned rubber. <laughs> Mike got a little bear right a little, there. A little hot. Go ahead. Yeah. Oh yeah, fall at the very last spot. Now here I am, I'm perched on the rocks here. You can see the cables all the way up there. It's about 10 feet in between each cable, so total over about 400 yards. Gonna be up there. If there was, I was gonna hurry a little bit, and nobody was there. I gotta kind of move slow. No, go for it. I'm just taking a couple pictures. I'm kind of shaky. Don't worry, I'll edit it out. Yeah, 
Malico brings up the rear. Carrying everybody's rear end. Just don't fall over. Look at that. Isn't that amazing. Coming down through there is just brutal. and squirrels. The squirrels here are freakishly huge. And uh, the, less, the lesser known mountain shark is used to grout the middle. Oh, okay, was that rolling?